Yeah. Is that why you're being as soft as shite with her? Hey, if I'm ever seven storeys up stood on the window ledge, I just hope it's not you two who send round to talk me down. Do you want to top up, Nige? Oh, uh, go on. Just a little one. Hey, uh, this is from the off-license robbery, is it, Ken? Now, you know me better than that, lads. You got any idea who did it, then? Yeah, we got a tip-off from a grass. Reckons it's a gang from the Lowfield Road estate. I'm not surprised. It's like Beirut down there, isn't it? Is it? I don't know. We won't go up there if we can help it, and if we do, we don't stop. The blue light's on, we're straight through. I don't blame you, lads. Keep your eyes peeled, though, Ken. Like we said, we're going round the pubs trying to offload it all now. The grass was definite about that. Will do, no prob. Who is the grass, anyway? Can't reveal that, Ken. He's in the witness protection programme. Is it when he pays? Yeah. All right, Granis. Joe, would you do me a favour? We mind Calvin from who I go up to our own, mate. You're joking, aren't you, Janice? Oh, please, Joe, be no trouble. He's asleep. I'm not Mary Poppins. I'm having a pint. Oh, please, Joe, I've got to get me figure back. His dad won't look at me if I don't lose my belt, eh? We don't know who the dad is. No. I want a fancy for his dad won't look at me. Bloody hell. Kids need a father, Joe. Oh, no. Oh, no. Please, Joe, I won't be long. Please. Go on, hurry up. Ah, thanks, Joe. You're a star. Nice. Hiya, Duffer. Hey, Janis. If he wakes up, he's buckled under his pillow. Oh, and Joe. Not near the baby, eh? Oh, <laughs> Bloody hell. Thanks, Joe. Any time, Janis. What's he like, eh? Could be yours, this. How come I'm looking after him? Hey, don't be spreading that about. It's everything that could ruin my marriage, that. What, well, having an affair, yeah? Oh, the missus finding out. Mm. Anyway. You can hardly call a knee trembling in Ladbrook's doorway in a fair, can you? Bet your wife's listers could if she found out. She's not gonna know, is she? Mm, let's not open that, eh? Mm. Exhibit A, Your Honour. Hey! <laughs> You're loving this, you, aren't you? Well, I'm just stating a fact. Good chance is yours. No chance. Bet your odds on at Ladbrook's. <laughs> <laughs> hey! Could have had a bet on yourself. Pity they weren't open. They were? <laughs> as long as he. Just like that, Winnie. The audience went wild. Oh, all right, Kenny. Yeah, I'm just setting the video for Footballers Wise. Now it's just reminded me. Hey, what about Reenie's lad in the paper? Oh, no. She'll be mortified, won't she? Yeah. I feel sorry for the poor love. I like Reenie. That's exactly what we were saying a minute ago, isn't it, Winnie? Yeah, that's exactly what we were saying a minute ago, Ken. Let's hope not many people have read about it, eh? It's a bit late for that. Some callous pigs had it photocopied. They was passing it around the bar last night. What sort of person would do that? You'd think you had nothing better to do with the lies, wouldn't you? Make sure it requires for me, Mum. I'll see you in a bit. Yeah, you've only just been, haven't you? Spend more time on the Jensen, George Michael, you. Oh, <laughs> yeah, I know. Uh, little enough for me now, Duffy. She wants to be prostrate. Do you want me to turn a tap on for you? Oh, no, no. I'll be all right in a minute. <laughs> Always takes longer when I'm stood next to someone. Right. Mm, I've uh, been filling Tommy about uh, the roadworks up on Samuel Street. <laughs> oh. oh, there she goes. Yeah, according to Toff, they have from the top end of Piper Street, past McVitie's up to the bank on uh, Birdall Lane. Have you seen it, Duffy? No. Never watched news night, Eddie. Yeah, they've uh, got temporary traffic lights up there. Causing havoc, it is. Havoc! You just pissed on your shoes, Eddie. Have I? Oh, nice. Mm. Yeah, there's uh, talk it's going to be all one way when it reopens. Did you know that, Duffy? I'll put it in my dining when I get home, Eddie. Did you know that, Joe? No, I did. <sighs> yeah, I'm going to have to go left, down to the traffic lights and all to a square, come back on myself, uh, uh, hang a left at the roundabout and rejoin it at the bottom of Eskett Street. Right, I did. Yeah, I've worked out that it's going to be an extra ten minutes on my journeys in the morning. 
That's no good, is it? Oh, or is it, Jack? No. Oh, what about you, Joe? Will you get stuck in it going to work? No. I usually get the train. Would you say the trains are more reliable, Joe? Leave me alone, Eddie. I'm having a shit. Right. Right off. <laughs> Uh, don't be expecting Joe back just yet, Duffy. He's having a shit. Cheers, Eddie. Oh. Joe's just having a shit, John. Oh, is he? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, that happened to me on Mrs. the other day. She went to see her sister for a quick brew. She's only been in there two minutes. Next thing, the car alarm goes off. So they go out to see to it, and some young scally's legging it down the path with a car steady under his arm. In broad daylight, this was. Bloody hell. Did she report it? Well, what's the use? You're right, it's terrible, isn't it? <sighs> anyway, see you soon, Ken. We better get off. Come on, come on, crack itself. <laughs> Cheers, Ken. Come on, Ken. See you soon. How's your game of cards, lads? Oh, wow, yeah. Oh, yeah, go on, then. What's that? That's a baby, that, Ken. I can see that, Duffy. Whose is it? It is. It's Janice Carr. She's just gone up to your mouth and over to class. It's not a bloody crest, is you know? Yeah, it's actually there, that. Oh, my. Ten P a corner? You don't care, you, do you? Is that you have, Tommy? Spend up, have you? No, I'm going to you, Randall's, for a smoke. <laughs> <laughs> I won't put it past you either. <laughs> Bloody miserable old sod. He can bring his marigolds in tomorrow and fish him out himself. <laughs> Dad, who's is that? It is. I told you my class is getting bigger and I need more room. You'll have to move your train set out there before the end of next week. Hey. Bloody hell, Mel. Oh, train set? <laughs> you didn't tell us about your toy train set, Casey Jones. It's just a hobby. It's huh? a five-year-old's game. <laughs> hey, are you having that, you lot? Hey, he's only got a toy train set upstairs, Thomas the Tank Engineer. Hey, <laughs> it's a proper Hornby. Woo! All steam locos or modern diesels, Ken. Mm -hmm. I don't want to talk about it, Eddie. <laughs> yeah, time flies by when you're <laughs> the driver <laughs> of a train and you ride on the footplate never back, back again. again. Choo choo! <laughs> Get up here now, you brought the baby up. Oh, That's all I bloody need. Oh, I'm going for the piss. Oh. 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 That controller's got a cob on. Didn't like it, did it? Oh, don't worry about him, John. He's all right, Ken. He don't mind a joke. I think you better go and get Janice. Right. Who is it? Hey. Who's rock wanking on my sign? Rushing through the stars, captivated by the world's beyond. So far unknown, floating in a car, past the gates of must destroy.com.